Angela Kelly is live in O'Connell Falls this morning. She joins us now with a look at the fire department's new training tower. Morning, Ange. Good morning, Pete and Rachel. Good morning, everyone. That's right. We're joining you live from Oconto Falls. You can see their ladder truck is up against their brand new training tower. And the crews are out here sort of uh, doing some demonstrations for us, showing us how this new building works. I'd like to introduce you to Captain Bart Magnin. Good morning to you. Good morning. Why is this training tower so important to Oconto Falls? It's really important because we can do a, a lot more here in Ocano Falls without traveling all the way to Green Bay, um, which is a big plus. And if we have to need more training, we can do it right here. Um, so it is a big plus for us that way. This is a volunteer fire department. As you said, for years you were driving from Green Bay all the way, uh, or from here all the way to Green Bay to get your training. Now it's right in your backyard, right on the same property as where your station is. Uh, what are the capabilities? Uh, what types of training can you do in here? We can do a lot of different things uh, as um, search and rescue, hose advantage, advancements. Um, we can do um, ladder work on the roof, roof ladders. We can vent on the, on a, on a, on the ground level. Um, we can do rich training out of it also. So there's a lot we can do rather than going to somebody else's facility and not be able to do some of the things we can do here. And what's really special about this is this is really a community effort to make this happen. That's right, yep. Everything that was donated uh, was from the, the, the area around us. So yes, that was a big thing for us that we didn't have to have the the taxpayers paid for it themselves as donation wise. Yeah, about how much did it did it cost to raise to make this happen? We had about $14,000 invested in it. And the rest was all done by our own people uh, building it also. Okay, incredible. Well, they are going to be doing some demonstrations for us throughout the morning. I may even get a chance to uh, use the ladder truck. They actually have a smoke machine in here where they can simulate a, a smoke-filled building. Hmm. Um, lots of cool stuff to see this morning, so stick around for that. Back yeah. to you. Thanks, Ange.